Stay Keto fam, welcome back to a brand new video. First of all, as you can see, if you were just wondering, I know you wasn't wondering. <laughs> I'm wearing Tom's clothes right now. Nothing fits me. We've got nine weeks to go guys. Officially we are on week 31 today. So happy 31 weeks, bud. Wow, that's today, isn't it? Yeah. Because you're gonna have a quarter Filipino baby, yes. you're gonna need to know how to make uh -huh. Filipino food. And I feel like And you did say that you will need to treat me today. Yes. So if you're new to our channel, I am half Filipino. I am really, really wanting caldereta. Um, but as you guys may know, um we don't eat beef. So we are on the way to the grocery store to find tofu. Tofu that is caldereta. that is the the goal right now so we're gonna make tofu caldereta it's a recipe that i saw online it looks so good but tom's going to make it today caldereta sounds like spanish you yeah know you i think it, it like is the rolling of the rock. i actually well, think caldereta. it may have originated from spain because oh, it's okay. quite like a, a tomato -y base yeah and yeah, so I kind of feel like, and it's well, I've had before. Yeah, it's just like a stew, and we love our vegetables, so it's like a whole bunch of vegetables. And I love anything pot. that like call me lazy, but I love any meal that you can like carry on for a few meals. Do you know? What oh, I mean? like, like yeah, you can like make a big pot of it and then just go and grab it whenever you need. It's so easy well, just to heat up. That is my dream meal. For well, Filipino food, there's always tira tira. So it's like, there's always like leftovers. Yeah, leftovers. So you never just that. make, you never, like, well, growing up, like, you never just make enough for that one meal. It's always like, there's always extra. Uh -huh. Just in case like guests come and then you can be like, oh, I made some caldereta earlier. Make sure you eat. That's like a fact. Oh, like, okay. Every time you go to a Filipino household, they will say, oh, um, I have, I made this earlier or I made this or this, or whatever. And then they'll like heat That's it up. Say you've planned dinner and somebody comes round, you would always go, oh no, eat with us, eat with us, because there's enough. Culture is like, crazy, isn't it? Crazy, so crazy how like yeah. cultures differ. I find it incredible, I find it fascinating. Um, but anyways, um, because you're gonna be a dad to a little Filipino boy. Oh my God, he's gonna be Filipino. Well, like quarter. A so you need boy? to get like all cultural now, because you don't only just have a half Filipino missus, you'll also have- A quarter Filipino boy. Son, son, yeah. So, Gotta get your skills up, honey. Before we go in the store, we need to do a quick bump update. It's nine weeks to go. Oh yeah. Quick bump update. Cut to montage. I get some bands and I get some bands and my little baby. I get some bands and I get some bands and my little baby. I get some bands and I get some bands and my little baby. I used to get this as a kid. What is it? Jelly. Mango pudding jelly, yeah, it's so good. You will eat anything if there's mango in it, bubs. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Let's find the Filipino section because apparently they've got like a really, really good Filipino Filipino section. section. Yeah. Okay, okay. Just found the Sky Flakes. What? And I have the Sky Flakes quiz for all the Sky Flakes eaters out there. Oh, yeah, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Question. Okay. How many holes? Does a sky flake have? Okay, let's give them the countdown. Do, 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 guys, press pause, head to the comment section right now. How many holes does a sky flake have? The reason why we asked you about the sky flakes is because we were quizzed on Filipino TV. The other day? The other day. We were actually on GMA in the Philippines and it's coming up, I think it's like August 3rd or something. So we had keep to an do eye like, out for um, it. Well, a Filipino quiz. Yeah, we had to do a Filipino quiz on the, on the program. So it was so jokes. <laughs> <laughs> so that was one of the questions which is what reminded us to so make sure you guys let us know if you see it and how many of they got it subscribers right? let us know if you've seen it by the way i've not even given the answer yet oh yeah the answer is 54. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Do you like, think people actually counted like quickly grab their sky flakes i would again. love i want to know if someone actually ran out of the room right then and found some sky flakes and started counting i want to know if that was you <laughs> you need to let me know in the comment section <laughs> guys we found the vegan section do I look cool in my mask like this, by the way? Yeah, it's like your bed is bed. <laughs> we found jackfruit. So we're going to have that in the caldereta with our tofu. Um, they do a whole different things like banana blossom. But yeah, we'll go, we'll go for jackfruit. You know what I really want to find? Ubi jam. Ubi jam, Ubi yeah. Jam. That's what I'm missing. 
we so have in, in Shark Island. When we were in Shark Island in the Philippines, we do it. Kim is having ube jam on toast every day. An egg, an egg. <laughs> an egg, ube jam, egg. Oh my gosh, we should so make that so if we, we can try find it. Start cooking. Uh -huh. We need to change this water. Okay, let me do it. You might remember these flowers from one of our latest videos when mm -hmm. Tom surprised me with flowers. The lilies hadn't opened up yet, but like, look how beautiful these are. Honestly, they are my most favorite flower. I think they're so beautiful. Just love the smell of these. Smell them. Just make sure it doesn't go on your clothes because it does stain. It smells so little... good. All done. Right, let's pop them in. Oh my god. <gasps> what did you just say? <laughs> You're stupid. That wasn't me. You just threw it at me. Okay, don't don't wipe it. What do we do to it then? <laughs> Wait. Get the hoover on it. Yeah, I think we should get the hoover. You literally said two seconds before that happened. Don't get this particular bit on your top because it stains. I was like, okay, and then you just went, whoop! <laughs> and they said it doesn't stain. Did you walk into it or did I bump into you? I don't know, but do you know what? I kind there of is, like There is evidence on this camera. I literally, guys, don't cook a single thing. <laughs> really? No, I've this been, is good practice. I have been really, really, really spoiled having Kim as my partner because now you can be a daddy gotta learn how to make yeah exactly now i'm gonna be a daddy and my little boy is gonna be like a quarter filipino then i need to know how to make traditional filipino meals don't mm. just mash it yeah yeah job number one done okay grab the onions 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 what if your eye shape? starts watering, you have to stick your tongue out. Why would my eye start watering? Because it's an onion. But it's a, red, a yellow onion. Doesn't it matter. <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs> Mind your finger! Okay, stop. No. I'm no, okay. this is getting dangerous now. I just need to do it low down. This is the technique. No, because you're closer to the onion. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Mind your farm, please. It's like talking to a child cutting like vegetables for the first time. Okay. Okay, Good. success. Right, chop the peppers. It says we only need a quarter, but let's do a whole one. You're gonna be in for such a treat today, Bobby. Because this caldereta is gonna be the nicest caldereta you have ever tasted in your entire life. Great. What am I doing with these potatoes? Am I peeling them? Yep. I love peeling. Potatoes. Why? It's just really satisfying. It's like, you know when you watch those videos on YouTube and they like peel stuff? So it's been almost forever since we last made Filipino food. I've not really been cooking big, big meals. No, you've right? not. Right? Yeah. You think I'm gonna I'm do it good? I think so. I'm, I'm like surprised you actually, when we spoke about this, I'm surprised you agreed to let me cook it. Okay, up next we've got carrots. My hand's hurting. <laughs> Doesn't that look like a finger? Ooh, look over there! What <laughs> a gnarly finger. Okay, so you kind of, you want to shred the jackfruit. Ew, I'm so nasty. Okay, done? Yeah. Do it with love, or else it ruins the flavour. <laughs> Quick disclaimer, just in case, because I know people will be saying, oh, why are you using those particular ingredients? That's not what you're using, Caldereta. I can already hear it already. Um, but... Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> liver pate we're using like lentils instead of using meat we're using tofu and jackfruit on the coconut milks replacing the cheese in caldereta so yeah in case you guys were wondering or you know are too fast to say that's not how you make it well we're following a vegan recipe guys okay it's so good oh look at all your ingredients <laughs> you're looking like a chef babe i know um are you ready I need something to cook it in 
Okay, so let's grab this white thing out with your hair, whatever it is, fluff. Okay. Probably jackfruit. Okay, so grab the big pan. <laughs> Oven on. Okay. Okay, um, splash some vegetable oil. Okay, so using a large pan or pot, turn on the heat and saute the garlic and onion in oil. I don't think the oil was ready. <laughs> What's it on? What number? number three. Put it on four. Okay. Sprinkle my salt in. How much salt? Okay, so sprinkle three pinches of salt. Pinch, pinch. One. Just throw it in. <laughs> it says sprinkle. <laughs> oh my god. You have to cook with love. Someone taught me that once. <laughs> If you don't cook with love, then it doesn't taste good, okay? Okay. So. Oh, we've just had an accident, guys. <laughs> so we've just had an accident. Help me! <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. There's nothing you can really do, you have to firm it. So like the onion is currently burning his eye. Because what did you do? He decided to smell the onion. And then I just touched the onion. And then you I wiped, touched on And then I wiped my eyes. To Why? Try to oh. oh my. Luckily, it's not an ER emergency casualty type of accident. It's just a amateur really chef. Earth is hard, isn't it? It's not hard, it's effort. Look at all of that stuff we've just prepared. It's effort, guys. Uh, Absolute um, effort. Weave. <laughs> yeah. I'm joking, you helped. <laughs> Oh, I just wanted to make something nice for you. Your it's eyes are disastrous. popping. I think they're popping because they're so red on the outside. <laughs> so sore. <laughs> okay, so how's no. our sauteing? Right, it's sauteed quite well. What's the next step? Okay, so... Are you sure? No, it's not even cooked yet. Oh, it's, it's still hard. Cook. Yeah, it's got to saute, so it's got to go all soft. Oh, well, give it five minutes. It's not soft yet. Yeah, it's not sorted yet. Should I dance for them? <laughs> <laughs> you have to put music in and edit or I'll just look stupid, okay? <laughs> okay. Son's kicking me right now. He really? Thinks, yeah, he loves all things dancing oh, and all I things. My boy, hello, my boy. He's so like, your belly's so hard, right? Yeah. Belly's really hard. Oh. I can't even see my toes anymore. Oh my god, you can't, can you? No, <laughs> you can just see your toes. So while Tom's having a rest and we're waiting for the onions to saute. Quick pregnancy update. I just want, I know you guys saw the bump earlier, but we have guys nine weeks to go. Honestly, cannot believe how fast time is going. There's obviously still a whole bunch of things that we still need to do. Um, so if you've not yet subscribed to our channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button because we have like just a whole bunch of things that I want to show you from like baby essentials to um, packing our hospital bag obviously baby's birth we're going to do like a whole series um, at the hospital um, obviously the name reveal we have coming up as well so if you're new to our channel make sure you hit that subscribe button join the keto family he's actually laying down on the sofa your onions are gonna burn i was just taking a rest Okay, right. Oh add no! Your, add your potatoes and peppers. Lower your heat as well. Oh shit. Ooh, that's looking like a caldereta. Is it? Yeah, it is. So whilst we're waiting for the potatoes to cook, Tom's going to make the rice, Filipino style. Why is it Filipino style, Tom? It's Filipino style because it's in a rice cooker, for one. Well, no, <laughs> most people cook their rice in a rice cooker. I grew but up, I never had I a know. rice cooker. I didn't know what a rice cooker was until I met you. Anyway, <laughs> you test how much water is in it, 
by doing the finger check. You check how much water is in it or? You check how much water you need yeah. by putting your finger in it. We and can't see, see it, go that side. Basically you put your finger in it and see where it comes up to. The technique is you put your finger in until it comes up to the first line. And if it comes up to the first line. On your finger. On your finger. That's just enough water. And that's how every Filipino makes rice. Right. Yeah, and it worked for me every single time. So if you don't know how much water to put in, just put your finger in. And guess what? No matter how big the bowl is, no yeah. matter how big the rice cooker is or the pot or whatever. Always works the same. Always works the it same. It always works the same. How weird is that? Mental maths, science. We are nearly done now. Rice is done. Rice just popped off. The caldereta is ready. We actually didn't show you guys putting the rest of the ingredients in, but we did. We put the rest of the ingredients in. It's all in there. The caldereta has, is now cooked. <gasps> I'm so excited. The video was just I'm getting hungry. really, really long, so Very we decided long. to cut it. We gotta edit this, so, you know. We also made some spring rolls. Mum actually pre-prepared these that were yeah. in our freezer. We saw them and was like, okay. We need some spring rolls. We need to do a really good mukbang after this. Ooh, so so we are actually going to do a video on its own. Yeah. Celebrating nine weeks, guys. Yeah, we are, guys. So make sure you turn on your post notification bell if you haven't already, guys, so you don't miss that next video. So I'm just going to transfer it into the bowl, but this looks so good. I kind of feel like we should try it. Can I try it? Okay. Can I try a piece of tofu? Or, or should we save it for the mukbang? Guys, I'm sorry. We're going to save it for the mukbang. For our next video. For our next video. So guys, if you haven't got your post notification bell turned on just yet, turn it on. And if you can't turn it on, it means you're not subscribed. So subscribe first and then turn on your post notification bell so you don't miss that next video. We're about to do a nine weeks, or we're about to have a nine weeks Filipino fiesta. 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 And I'm so excited because I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. And this looks so good. It does look good. And we've not taste tested we've it yet. We've not taste tested so it yet. So it better taste it better good. Better taste. Oh, oh, you can't put her oh, pressure on oh, me. Oh, you need to order a takeaway. <laughs> and Keto family, make sure you like this video for Tom putting in the effort yeah. to learn how to cook Filipino food in time for baby's arrival. Right. Okay guys, so this is the caldereta, vegan style. Okay guys, you really have to style. comment down below now and let me know how it looks. How it looks like, do? it does look like caldereta. It does? There is so much caldereta, I think it's enough for like a few days. Uh -huh. I almost feel like we should have invited people around. Yeah. Don't you think though, next time, huh. if it does taste good, mm -hmm. maybe you should cook for a keto family member. <gasps> That'd be cool. I'd be game for that. Would they be game for that though? That's the question. Guys, who would be up for that? Who'd be up for me cooking for them? That'll be <laughs> awesome. We need to work on that in the future. Yeah. Like how cool will it be to actually meet up with a keto family member? Oh, but that you would be cook cool. for them. That would be and cool. you guys could be the judge of Tom's cooking. <laughs> if Tom's done a really good job today, I think we should challenge him to what? cook more food on the channel. Well, you're a dead to be now, so. <sighs> You're gonna have to start cooking for me, especially like when we come out of the hospital. You never know, I might be craving caldereta, adobo. Um, oh. There's like a whole bunch of Filipino food that I really do miss. Okay. Um, like I said, it's always when mum's here, we kind of like request it. Yeah. Um, but great job today. You, you, how did it do? I think you've done good, but we don't you yet know. It yet. We are going to save. We're gonna save it for the next video. Yeah, guys, we're gonna do a mukbang. We're gonna do a mukbang. So guys, if you want to watch our taste test slash mukbang slash celebrating our nine, nine weeks. weeks. Our countdown. We will be having a Filipino food fiesta. Ooh, we got a few bits as well. We don't just have caldereta. We no. also have a few little bits. And I've saved my appetite. Baby is waiting for this moment. Baby is hungry. hungry. He is kicking. Down there, he wants some food, some good <laughs> ass food. So, guys, check out. Well, quickly subscribe, turn on your post notification bell you so me. you don't miss next video. Yeah. And we can really see and put Tom's cooking skills to the test. Oh no. Maybe I'll, I'll cook more Filipino food. Okay. Sound good? If it Sounds makes you good. happy, then deal. Guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, tell everyone about the vlog. And remember, as my beautiful missus to the right of me always says, in a world where you can be anything, remember to always be saucy. So and I don't kind. even know, I don't know what that means. See you in our next video, guys. Bye. <laughs> See you guys. Ingat.